Exactly. Yeah. Six two is the magic height, right? Or six three is the magic height. You can play anywhere. Like, yeah, I mean, if you keep it right in the middle there, <laughs> that's what the Nelsons. You know, they think it's an advantage. They limited themselves. That's true. That's true. <laughs> that's a good point. I didn't know about that. None of those guys are playing corner. Yeah. <laughs> Um, was it fun? Did you get a chance? To, I know you're locked in and you don't get a chance to get out much. Did you get a chance to see any of your brothers play? Yeah, during the bye week, I actually got to see both of them play. Did you? They both played at home. So, yeah, that was a lot of fun. Obviously, that's something, you know, with all of us doing it, you know, in my family, that is something we kind of focus around. So getting, getting to see him play is, is a big deal. I know Wakan is always good. Um, state title good, though. I know you guys were in the championship game, I think, right? Yeah, we were in the title. But, yeah, they, they won this year. They won handily. Um, yeah, I mean, they, they have a big deal for Wakanda. Yeah, absolutely. It's a you know pretty tight knit community, or small community, and you know having that experience, you know, being a football team, being able to rally around, bring everyone down. Obviously, I, I would bet the whole town was there in the dome that day. Mm -hmm. But yeah, it's definitely something positive, positive for the town. Are all you guys P? Yeah, Park Parker Payton Price. <laughs> that was planned, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I didn't know that. Yes. Well, that, that fun deal for your dad. Your dad uh, probably had zero regrets putting, what's the car that he would drive all around Eastern Iowa? Um, well, he had an Uplander, but they just changed this year. They got a new, a new Ford truck. Okay. That they would bring it down. So he didn't mind driving, probably. No, I don't think so. <laughs> Except yeah. for at the pump. Yeah. Yeah. I can't imagine that was, uh, that was easy. Thanks, Tim. What, yeah, sure. what about some of the younger players that have had development time? Uh, you know, what have you seen from some of those guys? Do you see that leap happening with some guys? Yeah, Might absolutely. I mean, it happens at different times, um, you know, for everyone. But you know, going through developmental is a great time, you know, to give the younger guys, you guys who haven't had as many, as many snaps throughout the season, you know, time to work on their skills and, and get a lot of attention. And, you know, there's been a lot of guys, you know, through through bowl prep that have really kind of started to emerge or you know, markedly been better. Um, yeah. Do you even see that with Vanessa? Yeah, I mean, AJ's guy, you know, every day bringing it, I'd say, you know, just every day comes out showing you something new. It's, it's exciting to play with him. Did you like this kind of eight-man rotation rather than the six-man? Yeah, I mean, sure. I think it helped, you know, just making each guy more efficient. You know, you always got fresh legs in there. Um, you know, I would assume it's pretty demoralizing as an offensive lineman. You know, they might have strung four or five plays together, but they got their hands on their hips, and we're bringing four new guys in right now. Um, you know, I can't imagine that's easy. 